This video is going to be on a serious note. I would like to apologize to Kelly Hogan. You see, when I first found Kelly's channel, I thought she was a parody channel like mine. I didn't believe people actually thought the carnivore diet was healthy. I assumed she knew this and was parodying someone who was completely delusional into thinking eating dead animals can heal the body. Boy, was I wrong. Now that I understand she's serious, <laughs> it breaks my heart because I wish I knew this sooner in order to prevent Kelly's feelings from being hurt. Carnists are sensitive, but I didn't think they were that sensitive. The slightest thought of consuming plants triggers them, and a wave of emotions hits them all at once. It's a very difficult and struggling lifestyle. It's my understanding that carnivores believe in their diet is very similar to fairy tales told to little children. For example, there is no evidence to support that eating animal-based long-term is beneficial to human health. This would be similar trying to convince kids that unicorns are real. In Kelly's mind, eating dead animals is a healthy fantasy, just like she can even be convinced that a horn can sprout from the skull of a horse. This is perfectly normal for kids to have these thoughts, but not so much for adults. It becomes pretty much a mental illness, and that is not something I should have made fun of. The carnivore diet imposes a mental handicap on its members, and I should have known better to go after Kelly. I suspected she would have some slight brain fog. However, I didn't believe it had progressed to the point where she would experience these horrifying hallucinations and follow such an odd and scientifically unproven diet. People like Kelly become mentally impaired when they devour big quantities of abused animals and are unable to recognize that my channel is a parody of other channels in the carnivore community. Kelly, I'm sorry. I should have taken your sensitive feelings as top priority over the millions of animals suffering from torture and murder from the diet you support. I went against my best judgment and instead hurt your delicate heart. I was selfish defending the defenseless animals that you choose to ignore because of your childlike views. I hope you accept my apology as it's sincere, and hopefully one day we can meet and collab on a video together.